Alright guys, welcome back to round number two against the Ottawa Senators here. We're going to quickly check their roster and then get into it. We bounced the um, the Boston Bruins in five games. Five games? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, no, six games actually, sorry. But they were all really, really close. One goal games, except for the last one. Jimmy Howard pinched a shutout there and uh, forcing us on to round number two against Eric Carlson's ex-team. So I'm hoping for big things from Eric and Carlson here. Uh, we do have an injury to deal with though and that injury is Jason Garrison as you can see we have Calvin DeHaan there as a replacement so that's not too bad uh, nothing too crazy quite yet but let's see how the Ottawa centers are looking oh boy Jimmy Ben's a 90 now oh boy Thornton and Bobby Ryan that is a dangerous first line oh my goodness wow their team is stacked Mahalik Turris MacArthur uh, Booth Zabinajad who's at 84 wow their depth down the middle is crazy uh, Colin Green Chasen Smith and uh, Adam Burrish there. That's crazy. Yeah, their defense really looks weak now that we took Eric and Carlson from them. Cowan, CC, Mathot, Gleason, Phillips, and Eric Griba. Lots of defensive defensemen, actually. Um, five of their six are actually defensive defensemen. And they have Craig Anderson and Robin Lander. So a really good one-two punch in net there. So uh, this is going to be a really good series, much like the Bruins one. I'm um, really actually excited for this let's go first period game number one at home round number two the joe is rocking let's go first period zero zero oh that was anticlimactic uh second period zero zero again 18 to 15 are the shots maybe another goaltenders duel here uh craig anderson versus versus jimmy howard uh, two all-stars going at it here Oh boy, this is uh, it's gonna be a really close one. Twenty-four shots, super even, super super even. I'd say we're a really even team. Oh, Eiserman, twelve seconds left on a deflection. Oh man, I wish I could have watched that. That was so sick. Twenty-six, twenty-five are the shots, and we squeak by with a one nothing, uh, one nothing victory there. So wow, that was uh, that was nice. <laughs> I like games like I got. I like games like that. Wow. I was not expecting that to happen. That's awesome. All right, so we're up one nothing here. Uh, no injuries. Doesn't really look like it. Did we get past the first round? Our AHL team. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we did. We swept them. Swept them there. Uh, Jimmy Howard back to back shutouts though, which is really nice. Uh, game number two here. We're still at home. Let's go. First period. Two nothing. Ben. Oh Ben. Oh Ben. I love Jimmy Ben. You guys wanted me to trade him. Honestly, if you guys didn't pressure me to trade him, I probably wouldn't have but then again we did get Eric and Carlson but I'm a huge Jamie Ben fan but uh, I can't let that happen right now <laughs> come on Ben don't do this to me bro uh, second period three nothing oh my goodness Thornton with the three nothing goal uh, really clay uh, really tight with the, with uh, the shots but not on the scoreboard all right so it looks like uh, as a been a jag it's a four nothing goal oh boy yeah they uh, come out flying here came out flying all right, so uh, tied up one to one. The slate is wiped clean. That was a statement game, though. I don't like losing games like that. Uh, I didn't see how many points Jamie Ben had. Probably three. Probably three. Uh, yeah, it looks like he had a pretty good game there. But I'm waiting for Kane to put some pucks in the net. Come on, buddy, let's go. Uh, we are in Ottawa here at the Scotia Bank. Center is that it? Scotia Bank? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah it is. All right. Let's go. First period. Zero zero. Second period. Zero zero again. Wow, this is such a close series. Chris Kelly, fourth liner, ex Ottawa Senator. If I'm correct, is he an ex Ottawa Senator? Maybe not. Maybe not. Actually, I don't think he is. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. Oh no, Mahalik on the power play. Jeez, this is really close. Uh, I don't know if Chris Kelly actually is. That's kind of stumping me right now. But right in overtime, 42 to 25 are the shots. Jesus, Craig Anderson. Ah, uh, come on, come on. 10 minutes. Let's end it here. Oh, fucking tourists. Are you serious? We have 45 shots. Anderson stops 44 of them. Give me a break. Oh, Kyle Turris. 
Kyle, Kyle Turris. All right, all right, whatever, whatever. Um, we're down two to one now. That's not good. I don't like this. I do not like this one bit. Not a fan right now. Not a fan of what's happening right now. This is a must-win game for our team. So must-win game here. I don't care what you have to do. Make it happen. Get some goals on the board. Let's go ahead and let's beat Craig Anderson here. If we can't score more than three goals this game, I may have to change something up on the first line because Kane needs to be scoring more and he's not. So first period, 0-0, zero, zero, second period, one nothing. Jamie Ben with his third goal of the series here. This is like some ice tilt going on right now. Look at this, 30-19. to 19. Jared Cowan, are you fucking kidding me? Jeez, there you go, Kane. Thank you. Finally, fucking find the back of the net. About time, buddy. I'll pay you 8.8 .8 million for nothing. Jeez, man. Come on. Oh, this is a bin of jet on the power play. Are we seriously going to be down 3-1 right now? Is this seriously a thing? Bruh, are you serious? Oh, that's so frustrating. That's retarded, man. That is retarded. We have outshot them in two of the three games that we've actually lost. Uh, ben with his fifth goal of the playoffs. All right, let's go. Uh, let's change some up here. We're only scoring two goals in the last three games. What is up with that? Not a fan. Our goal scoring needs to be spread out here. Let's go ahead. Let's put... Um, I don't even know what to do. Uh, let's move Kane down. Let's put... Uh, Nyquist there. Tarasenko has really done nothing, eh? What has he done in the playoffs? One goal in ten games? Uh, that's not good. We'll move Mantha up. I want to give Mantha the shot here. He's, uh, probably not even that better. Two assists. I mean, we'll give him the shot, move him up. Uh, it's going to be Kane, Huberto, Mantha, Iserman, Tavares, Nyquist. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Carlson, you need to step it up, buddy. You need to step it up. Let's move Hamilton up. Uh, let's just change some stuff around here. Let's just change it up a little bit. Change her up, and uh, change is good. We could go home here, boys. I'm not going home. We're putting on a performance tonight. We're making a statement. Here we go. First period. There you go, Kane. Right away, first shot. Woo, that's what I like to see. Second, or sorry, first period. Three to nothing. Tavares, Chris Kelly, the ex-Ottawa Senator that I'm not too sure if he actually was or not, uh, and Patty Kane there. Second period, 5-0. Nick Spalling and Patty Kane. There you go. Moving Kane down was the right thing to do. Spread out the wealth a little bit. Spread out the scoring. Thank you. We explode with five goals. Thank you, God. Thank you, based God. Oh, thank you. Thank you, based God, Kane. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 5 to nothing victory. Both of our... Uh, victories here have been shutouts mind you so that's good um mantha with one assist there so i thought that was actually really smart moving patrick kane down i like that i like that uh, all right, so we need to win back-to-back -back games here. We need to win three in a row, actually. Uh, do they lose anybody? I just want to check. Um, player injuries? Nobody. They didn't lose anybody. Let's go here. Another must-win game here. Our backs are against the wall. Patty Kane, I'm banking on you, man. 8.8 .8 mil. You're showing up right now. Statement game. You had a great game last game. Let's keep it up. First period, 0-0. Zero, zero. Okay, second period, 0-0. Zero, zero. Oh, no. I hate games like this. I fucking hate games like this. Penalty kill. Okay, 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 okay. Come on. There you go, Justin Abicator. How clutch has Abicator been? He has been so, so, so clutch. I'm clapping, and I don't know why. I'm clapping because we won a game, and now we've pushed game seven, and I'm clapping because Jimmy Howard is an absolute machine is what he is. Three wins, three shutouts. Shutout there, shutout there, and a shutout there. Shutouts for everybody. Shutouts for you. Shutouts for your grandmother. Shutouts for your mother. Shutouts for your dog. Shutouts for your auntie. Shutouts for everybody. Uh, game seven. We've pushed a game seven. What an exciting series this has been. Injuries, nobody. This is big. All right, let's take a breather here. Whew, everybody just exhale real quick. Exhale. All right, let's go. Putting the controller down. Simulation do work, son. Uh, preferably in our favor, please. Uh, all right, so 10 minutes in, 7 to 4 power play. You got to capitalize on those boys. You got to capitalize. I like the line changes, though. I feel like that's a big impact. Penalty kill. God, Jared Cowan, I hate you, you big bastard. Come on. Penalty uh, power play for us. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. We need some goal support. Kaner, I know I've been harping on you lots, buddy. Where's Eisenman? 
harping on Kane for so long, for so long. I forgot about Eiserman. All right, one nothing. Twenty shots. We got this, boys. We need a goal here before the ten minute mark. Please, 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 please. There you go, Eric Carlson. Thank you, God. Oh, against his old team, coming through just clutch. Eric Carlson with a slap shot from the point, beating his next teammate Craig Anderson. Five minutes left. Oh no, game seven OT. This is like this. Are you? Serious right now. Oh, I don't even know what to say. Oh, that's so fucking dumb. 19 seconds left. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Are you fucking kidding me? 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 You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm pretty sure you're fucking kidding me. Oh. Ripped our heart out of our chest after we win three in a row and Jimmy Howard plays so good we let one in with 19 seconds left and it slips away to us like that are you fucking kidding me oh I'm actually like legitly upset right now I'm so mad that was oh man that is so retarded I'm actually upset like I seriously thought we we're gonna pull that one out Oh, hits your boss again. I was hoping for an amazing playoff run with Salvage, but frankly, performance not off to par. I'm not happy with the year results. Well, buddy, either am I. 19 seconds. Fucking BS. I'm not even going to edit that burp out. That's how much I don't even care. Oh, that is so upsetting and frustrating and mad and oh Philadelphia let's kick let's kick um wait actually what I'm gonna do uh I'm gonna quickly scout someone here uh ghoulies in the queue whatever um I want to cheer our AHL team are we eliminated no we're not let's send down Anthony Mantha uh to get some more progression but fuck is that ever just so lame and just so stupid 19 seconds I hate that number 19 what a stupid number Ugh, what a retarded number. Zerodoff, come up. Um, Anthony Mantha, go. All right, whatever. Uh, another dis just disappointing playoff run. I don't know, man. I don't know. Uh, hopefully we can come away with a uh, Calder Cup here. That would be kind of nice. That would make me feel a little bit better. Uh, Garrison, thanks for coming back, buddy. Uh, Flyers, did the Flyers beat? Oh, yeah, so it's Flyers in, in Calgary in the Stanley Cup Finals there. So thank God that they actually lost, uh, that being Ottawa. So uh, we're up 3-0 here. We're going to take a Calder Cup championship. There we go. Anthony Mantha had 12 assists. What? He played like six games. What a machine. Holy shit. Uh, we'll check his stats out, do a year-end wrap. But man, I just hate having such a good playoff run and it's just like, nope, 19 seconds left. I'm going to be a dick and I'm going to be a dick. And that's basically it. Calgary won the Stanley Cup. We come away with another Calder Cup uh, championship. Let's go to Detroit here. Um, all right. That is, it's depressing. It, it sucks. It sucks. It's no fun. Zero fun. Like, zero. Zero, zero, zero. Oh, that is just depressing. That's depressing. But we got to move on here. Got to hold our heads high. Um, try to anyways. I mean, ah, I just want to. I mean, we're, we're three years in now going in on our fourth year. It's make it or break it time right now. Like, Tavares is in his prime. Kane's in his prime. It's time to happen now. We need, like, an eight-mile speech right now. I got to make something happen. It's got to happen now. And I agree, it's got to happen right fucking now. Um, Sean Day, yeah, I'll check all that crap. So, let's do a quick uh, year in performance here for the awards. Calgary won their second Stanley Cup in three years. Uh, presidents went to Edmonton. Yep, the NHL is uh, completely changed. <laughs> Art Ross went to uh, went to Phil the Thrill. Hart went to the Nuge. The Norris went to Dustin Byfluglian. Dustin Bufflin. Uh, Calder went to Druan, actually. Uh, the Consmith went to Jonas Hill. It's always the goaltender who wins it. Uh, Vesna went to Corey Schneider. Uh, looks like we didn't take home any hardware. What the hell? Uh, nothing, hey? Wow. Nothing at all. Grand Rapids wins their third Calder Cup in four years. That is awesome. Uh, did we win anything? Um, quickly just want to check here. Sam Reinhardt. Uh, Grand Rapids. Okay, so... 
Darcy Kemper won the best goaltender. That's kind of nice. And he won the most valuable player award. That's cool. Um, Darcy Kemper took home some hardware. Lowest goals against average. Calder Cup. All right. So that's cool. Kemper played great. And uh, player stats, playoffs. I don't know. Uh, that's just... Uh, I feel like we should have had... This is, stri this is stripped away from us, man. And it's just like... ah. That sucks bums. Uh, Kane, Tavares, 9-7. I mean, Eiserman had four points in 13 games. He had such a good playoffs last year, 13-13, and 13, and yeah, I definitely didn't have a great playoff at all. Um, Kane tells Zotto's now at 86. He went up one. Uh, Huberto, I'm not going to look quite too much at this, but that's how that was looking. Let's check Mantha. How did Mantha do in his HL? He had 14 assists in eight games. Holy crap. What a beast. What a machine. What a tank. Um, I mean, Tarasenko only had one goal, right? Like, uh, Hamilton didn't play that great. Uh, it's just a bad playoff for everybody. Just a bad playoff. Howard didn't play bad at all. You can't blame it on Jimmy Howard at all. Um, you cannot blame it on Howard. Did I see that right? Did Jimmy Howard go down to an 86? Oh, boy. We might be in a goaltender problem here. Uh, let's check the retirements here. Uh, I don't really care about anyone else. Fuck everybody else. Did we lose anybody? No, we didn't. Um, who retired? Dasuk hasn't even retired yet. So Whitney Doan, Savar Dvorak, all these old scrub dub dubs, and um, Brodeur, Voku, and Backstrom, Thomas, and Scotty Clemenson. Those are your goaltenders that did retire. Let's see uh, who grew and who got worse. So Abacator, um, we'll see here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. DeHaan's now at 79 as opposed to a 78, which is which is great, which is awesome. Hamilton's still at 86. Uh, Honk is a 75, so he could really challenge for an NHL spot next year. Howard's at 86. No. No, no, no. We got to trade. Do we trade him? I don't know. Is there going to be two pieces who we might have to trade? Uh, that's going to be up to you guys. That is just... Uh, fuck, that sucks. Uh, Irwin to Huberto, um, Carlson, Kelly, Conan, K K uh, Darcy Kemper there. No one else got too great, doesn't look like. Uh, Masaryk, a 79, Nyquist. So that's how that's looking, guys. What do we do with Jimmy Howard? What do we do with Cromwell? Do we go ahead and make that Cronwall deal and then try to work something out with Jimmy Howard. Maybe we should have went and got that goaltender because uh, where is he actually? He's on Dallas. Let's go to the, let's go to Dallas really quick here. Uh, Dallas, 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 Dallas. Um, goaltenders, rookie goalies. He is now a 54 still, so he's only a 54. Um, but he'll probably get his big jump for next year. I mean, he's too good. He's too good not to not to get that jump like an 83, 84. Four for this year. So, uh, I mean, for goaltender wise, uh, Oscar Dansk is a guy who we could go get. He's someone who I've seen get really, really good in GM mode. So we could get Oscar Dansk from um, not from Detroit, from Columbus. He is uh, probably going to be relatively low trade value, and he's really young, isn't he? He's 22, four gro four green stars. So we could, that could be an option for sure. Oscar Dansk, cool. I want to take a look at him. So remind me in the comments for Oscar Dansk. Uh, I don't know. We could look at other goalies in the um, in the draft, but that's disappointing. I was really hoping for a lengthy playoff run. I mean, round number two, yeah, it's great, but uh, I just really wanted. And I, we we had that. We had that. It sucks. We had that, and it was ripped out of our hands. So uh, our best statistical year, 109 points. Uh, scored a ton of goals, and uh, yeah. That is how it's looking. So I will see you guys in the next one. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully you're not as depressed as I am. But I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, tell me what to do with Howard. And what do we do with Nicholas Cronwall.